We're back at Pink Inc. Wholesaler selling products to retailers. We're doing two years, 2020 and 2021. You have to provide both the original entry and the transactional entry for each scenario each year. Company standing in December 31st, record adjusting entries annually, income statement method, no reversing entries. Now, I'm going to page down. You probably noticed something really, really interesting. This is already filled out and it's filled out and it looks like the balance sheet method. Why? Because you cannot use the income statement method on any long lived assets. The income statement method only works on current assets and current liabilities that require adjusting entries. So you can use the income statement method on things like prepaid rent and prepaid insurance and supplies and prepaid expenses, prepaid subscriptions. You can use it for any of the unearned revenues because a customer paid you in advance and you're going to provide services over time. But you cannot ever use the income statement method for long lived assets. That includes buildings, equipment, furniture and fixtures, software, intangibles. No long lived assets can use the income statement method. So what I'm showing you here is the balance sheet method from a previous video that I've already done. Don't ever attempt to use the income statement method for any long lived assets. It's not permitted and it doesn't make sense. We can't expense 100% of our equipment and then bring it back. It's not going to work. It's never going to work. Long lived assets only use the balance sheet method.